that I've had as a judge or as a prosecutor, which is in excess of 26 years uh, combined, where there was a conviction that I knew of or that I was involved in without a body. Police say DeAndre Lane killed his daughter. She wet the bed and DeAndre spanked her with a punishment stick. According to the testimony, Everyone in the house hears this horrific screaming, this crying, after there's a beating. He then is in the front room with his nephew. He goes to check on baby Bianca. He brings baby Bianca back into the living room where the nephew is. He remembered that baby Bianca was alive. And I said, well, you know, how did he know? He said, well, her eyes was wide open. She kept looking and she was stinking. He starts trying to stand her up, almost as using her as a prop to say she's alive. DeAndre says on that morning, December 2nd, 2011, he was carjacked and his baby Bianca was taken along with the car. There wasn't much evidence and no eyewitnesses. Three witnesses have said they saw Bianca alive after police say she was killed. So how was DeAndre Lane convicted? The key? Police brought in a cadaver dog who sniffed the crime scene and barked, indicating the presence of a dead body. These dogs that were used in order to find baby Bianca were very instrumental. Um, they were taken to a house on Montgomery. Of 10 rooms in the house, it went straight to the bedroom. The car was held in an impound area. There were 35 cars that went straight to that car back seat, as well as the car seat was hidden at that location. The dogs went straight to where the car seat was hidden. So these cadaver dogs were very, very useful. When you talk about a circumstantial case, this is textbook. Judge Evans' job is to remain impartial. Looking back, she believes the jury got it right. Obviously, this was a very emotional case. There wasn't a lot to work with. In my mind, I was concerned that despite the evidence, there is no body, no physical body. Does this jury, lay people, have the training and really the courage to do the right thing? What well, they did. And Dondre Lane was convicted of first degree murder. sent him there a lot stronger than he has anywhere else. And then when he's gone out over the second time, he's decided, yes, that's what I'm looking for, and that's when he's given me the bark indication. Um, what we should understand with this dog is that he only barks when he finds something.